everything I've gotten out of each fight is that I'm learning more about myself and I'm not sure who I am as a fighter yet. What do I as a person get out of it every time I do this? With each fight, I've done something different. Physically, I know how to do it, and this trip towards this fight is me actually coming in touch with that mental aspect. I didn't plan on fighting when I came here. I just wanted to get back into shape after my son was born. As time went on, I, I guess I just wanted to get in the ring and, and fight. Stronger, faster, leaner. Let's go, Mendez. show you that I'm skilled, I'm talented, and I can run with the best of them. I'm not just fighting for me or girl fight, but I'm fighting for everybody that's in the scene in New Jersey, and I want to represent us the right way. With Deanna, I think she's having some self-doubt. She works long hours, and she's a single mother. She's so stuck in her head. She doesn't need to be. She's beating herself up too much. It comes time for the fight, and if you can't get out of your own head, then she may lose. You gotta keep pushing when you start to feel that maybe you're not good at this or maybe you're not as strong as someone else. And you gotta keep training so that you find your own strength. Because I think you got on yourself too hard last time. I wouldn't put you in there if I didn't think you were capable of doing it. You get in there, you do what Mendez does. I got a lot to uh, prove for the girls. We're a team and I uh, just wanna make this school proud. Uh, I just don't wanna let anybody down. After three rounds of action in the featherweight division, we have a majority decision. Fighting has taught me how to just kind of deal with life a little better and that a lot of things that people make a big deal about are not really that big of a deal.